you guys. Um, uh, do you mind if I borrow her? Is that okay? It'll only take a minute. I'm going to put her on TV. What's your name? Sarah Margaret. How old are you? Free. Sarah Margaret, and you're free. Gee, Mike said he was looking for a cute co-host, but this is over the top. Sarah has the ability to name any car she sees anywhere. She's only three and a half. All right, what's that one? Over here. Uh, Infinity. Infinity. Good job. What's this one? This uh, gray thing. Honda. At least she's smarter than him, which isn't saying much. In tonight's show, Mike heads to Charles. Welcome to a parking lot. Uh, it's the Carolina Traveler Show, and we're here for a good reason. I want to introduce you to tonight's co-host. Yes, we have a guest co-host tonight. That's Preston, not the co-host. That's his wife, Meg, not the co-host. I'll show you the co-host. There she is. I see Mike finally found someone who is his intellectual equal. I invited Sarah Margaret to be our co-host because she has an unusual talent. She can name any car in the parking lot. Well, maybe she's actually smarter. Honda. Mercedes. Mercedes. Well. You knew, you knew it was a Subaru. Okay, welcome back to the show. Sarah Margaret, my three-and-a-half-year-old co-host. Say hello again. Hello. Very good. You're getting very quick with that. I appreciate it. Do you like your vegetables? You do? Are there any vegetables you won't eat? Uh, no. <laughs> She's just saying that, isn't she? Are there any vegetables she won't eat, Mom? <laughs> Welcome back to the Carolina Travel Show. I'm Mike Redding. My co-host, Sarah Margaret, three-and-a-half-year-old wonder kind. Can she can name any kind of car? What kind of car is that? Uh, Acura. Acura. What's this one? Ford. <laughs> now, she can't read, so she can't assemble the letters. She just does it by the logos, but, hey, we're supposed to be holding hands. What's that? Volvo. Volvo. Here's a story about someone else who can't assemble letters either. Okay, we're on the coast, working hard. You've probably never seen a car like this. Because look, it's also a pickup truck. Oh, it's a car, and it's a pickup truck. All right, I'm going to tell you what it says right here. El Camino, one of the greatest cars ever made. We've established that this is, this is an El Camino, and it's a car and a pickup truck. Can, can a car go in the water? No! No, right? Well, I drove a car in the water. Here's the story. I'll go get a rag to watch down the He first told us about the car. Well, for the TV show tonight, I want you to yell as loud as you can. Scream! Ah! You can make it louder. Come on! Ah! Probably a good enough reason to drive to Spivey's Corner, North Carolina, on a hot summer day. Oh, go! Are you ready, young man? Go! All you need is a fire truck, a fire hose, and enough Vaseline to smother ten watermelons. My, na my name is Cody Glassy, and I did it just for. My name's A.C. Melford. I'm from Franklin, Delaware. And this is the, uh, I've heard about it, but I've never been here. And as much fun as this is, it's not the reason all these people drove to Spivey's Corner. Are you going to do any hollering? Yes. Well, give me, give me. Hi. Hello. Okay, now we're just approaching you, right? You've never met us before? <laughs> this is Sarah Margaret. Uh-huh. I'll bet you five dollars. She's three and a half years old. She can tell you what kind of car you drive. Chevrolet. 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 <laughs> Good. She's so smart. Okay, pay up. <laughs> Have you ever seen a plant that can eat a human? No! Well, that's the response I was looking for, because of course not. Keep, keep your skirt down. Welcome back to the show. I'm here with my new co-host, Sarah Margaret. She's three and a half years old. Say hello. Hello. Hello, there you go. Okay, what kind of car is that? 
Ford. At the Ford. Sarah has the uncanny ability to look at a car and know what it is at three and a half years old. What's that one? A Mercedes. A Mercedes. That's we... a Mustang right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Mustang right there. <laughs> hey, you ever played bingo? No. Yeah. Bingo's for old people. Those are really bad. You don't want anything to do with those. They're just bad. Through and through. Kansas Jayhawks, no good. Got it? All right. The Carolina Traveler is sponsored.